and gentlemen, all seated in front of your televisions, welcome to Planet Vet. Being able to free ourselves of imported weight flow resonates as an alternative for our country. It is through our this movement that small and medium-sized businesses have decided to develop the production quality of this local flow for pastries. To break out these retrograde apprehensions, we went to meet two ladies who transformed this free gluten into real delicies. Blanche Umesom and Sulami Mogen will make you language throughout this documentary that I suggest you to watch with the greatest attention. Let's meet just after this moving. The advent of Made in Cameroon has given rise to particular interest to companies who have launched into the transformation of tubers and cereals into flour with the aim of providing raw materials to some local businesses and households. According to the Ministry of the Economy, Planning and Territorial Development, during the year 2021, Cameroon imported wheat and wheat flour worth 180 billion francs CFA, a figure which can be revised downward by the change in our eating behaviors. Indeed, if the few processors present on the ground try to convince us of the benefit of this flow on health and our balance, ordinary customers struggle to gain a foothold. First of all, production quality, taste, and cost are often cited as reason for this reluctance. On the quality of the production of this local flour by small businesses, we went to meet Solamin Mogen, and it will be difficult to question the process by which this powder is obtained. When the cassava root arrives at the factory, she manages it. It is then detached from its skin by the employees. Then, it is washed in large beans until complete scarlet white. The cassava generally arrives in the evening. Once the cassava is removed from the field to arrive at the factory, it takes within 24 hours maximum. People generally come with the cassava around 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. Others, when the distance is long, they arrive around 2 a.m. So early in the morning by 7 a.m. We start peeling. The peeled cassava is then washed and at the level of washing, we will separate the cassava which is colored white, which has no stain to make the flour and the remaining part will be soaked. And what is soaked will be used to make fufu and many others. The complete process will lead to the acquisition of a good quality flour. Beyond making flour on a daily basis, Sulamit promotes them in many often unsuspected products. It is for two of them and also to break taboos and misunderstanding on the quality and effectiveness put forward on the subject of our local flour that will follow the dynamic lady into her kitchen, a place that she considers as a personal laboratory. From the outset, she presented to us the ingredient that will permit her to make pancakes and cupcake based on cassava flour. I will make cassava flour cupcakes. For this, we will need 150 grams of cassava flour, 70 grams of sugar, depending on those who consume a lot, but I choose 70 grams of sugar. 75 grams of butter, 1 12 gram sachet of powdered milk. I will add water so that it makes 80 grams of milk. One hundred gram of oil and four eggs. Then with clean hands in a clever mix of ingredients and mixture, the semi-finished product are put either in a pan or in the oven. So, we are going to start measuring our butter because we are going to melt it.
Le téléphone de notre bain. We are going to set the oven to 200 and set it to 3 minutes. It is important to preheat the oven before putting the extra mold in. And so, it was with pleasure, 20 minutes later, that beautiful pancakes and succulent cupcakes were presented to us. Here, we are at the end. We have our cassava flour cupcakes. And our pancakes presented in different weights rolling or folding or into a triangle enough to language while waiting for this delicious mengere to land in our stomach sula meat essentially produces quality local flour for other ling in the chain on this subject we went to Shell Village in Douala in the littoral to meet Blanche Omesum, a professional pastry, a great defender of local initiative. Bonjour, madame. Bonjour, ça est la bienvenue chez Merci. Devon Bakery. Merci. Blanche is the boss of Devon Bakery. It was in 2008 that the 40 years old woman launch into entrepreneurship um, first of all from the pastry domain i did a hotel training in 1919 in 2008 i launched into entrepreneurship why entrepreneurship i have an association that is the dove many know about me as a many children victim from sexual abuses subsequently in 2015, through a humanitarian mission in Colombia, she discovered what made her decide in favor of local flow. In 2015, I went for a humanitarian mission at Colombia. In fact, I went for a training and that is when I made a discovery at their home. About 70% of their meals were made up of cassava and corn. So at breakfast, we were sport of choice and more. And that is how, for the first time, the woman who invited me started talking about gluten and its effect on her. From there, I thought it was possible to produce flour out of cassava and corn. Back in Cameroon in July 2017, the assertive lady decided to embark on the transformation but like all beginnings, nothing turns to be easy. I went back with two challenges. Firstly, transform our flowers and create work. Secondly, proposing products without gluten. 
I was focused on it. There was a particular pastry I wanted to do, truly a particular one with corn. I really appreciated it there. They call it pili, panada in Spanish. Pili here and it was primarily made top of corn. Since here we produce pili mostly everywhere on the road and it's vulgar. I thought of innovating with pili made up from corn. I went to the market and bought corn and grind it, but I was deceived to see that we don't have the same flour, the same corn. Then I went to the market and bought all the types of corn to see which one was suitable. Unfortunately, it wasn't the case. With no failure or false success, Blanche benefit throughout this experimental journey from the expertise of second-hand drippers who do not hesitate to encourage her to continue in this path. In July 2017, when I started this adventure, I went to the market, bought fresh cassava, potatoes, and when I was back home, I transformed them and people tasted. The first people to whom I tasted encouraged me a lot. It wasn't the best pastry, but it was a couple with children. They told me, Blanche, that cake is very sweet. Don't you think we can improve this or that? This has been the boss. I think we can improve this. It might be my type. That is how. The activity started up to today. After a year of unsuccessful attempt, she finally had access to quality local raw materials, an essential element for successful high-value added pastry. I was buying tubers and using them fresh. I could boil or grate to do a pastry. Thus, I understood the limits of this pastry because even when producing bread that I mixed with wheat flour, fresh potatoes, it wasn't flour. I think it was six months later that I discovered flour through my present supplier. After understanding the limits of tubers used directly because the story is delicate and of short run, but I was in a position of having products of long conservation, which could be sold abroad. The enthusiast gluten-free does not hesitate to highlight the risk of storage of best flour on the market with the ongoing Ukrainian crisis. For me, the risk is to have really For me, the risk is to have quality raw materials. I insist on this. It is true. Many people produce flowers but all of them are not usable in pastry. There are preliminaries, in fact, there are varieties of cassava suitable to produce flour as well as plantain. So if that is not the case, we cannot have a good quality of flour. Thus, there is, is quality raw material and also when the raw materials are not in abundance, even the prices might be too expensive. First of all, it aimed to remain a reference in dairy gluten-free product so sought after by certain patients. We want to be a reference when they talk about firms without gluten in Douala, Cameroon. We have a position that makes us to work more, create, seek, innovate constantly because there is competition that does not sleep. Thus, to maintain the position we wish to have, we have to challenge daily. And this is the chance I have to concentrate on this activity. Furthermore, she remained outward of the difficulties encountered and yet to become overcome. Oof. There are always difficulties for young entrepreneurs like us difficulties in packaging, having adequate equipment, and thirdly, the difficulty of having human resources, as I said, quality. There are human resources, but quality human resources are few, and it is difficult for small firms like us, 
since youth prefer to work in multinational firms, thinking that small firms cannot give them enough according to their aspirations. Devon Bakery's finished product are displaced first in their displays and at different partners such as station and supermarket. Uh, for our product marketing, we are negotiating contracts with some distributors, unlike gas stations. We already have two gas stations who validated the distribution. We also look up to supermarkets because we were waiting for our product to be certified. We have it already, thus this was a guarantee of the good quality of our product to be referenced in market areas. Devon's bakery creation on display, a tool of Ezol, allow us to discover more. At Devon Bakery, we have four ranges of products. We have biscuit, bread, cakes, sweet. Here we have a range of our product that is biscuit. For example, we have plantain biscuit with cocoa bean. Here we have potatoes biscuit with sesame. Here we have cassava with chocolate and peanut locally made. And here, corn shortbread with local corn. These products are diverse and varied. A common point brings them together. They are all local flour. What about the production process? To find out more, we are happy to accept the guided tour of the production room to which we are invited. Here, the health protocol is extremely rigorous. Hands wash, shoes exchange in place of new ones, the appropriate blues abhor, hands disinfected and hair protected. We are in the store dedicated to raw materials. Where? We found local floor of all kinds in storage. As you can see here, we have potatoes, cassava, plantain, fonio, tiger nut, rice, corn, egusi, flowers. We have about 10 flowers. Now, it is time to exit to the store for production. Exactly, according to Devon Bakery Forward Movement Principle, we will have the storing zone. After the storing zone, I introduce you in the production zone where we are going to discover how we produce the different cakes, bread, biscuit. As you can see, the team is already working on the cookies you people like. Blanche Omisom offers to make corn flour cupcake for us. Therefore, it is necessary to take into account the ingredient for this realization. For our tomato cake, we need tomatoes. We have corn flour. Sugar cane. We have eggs, and here melted both. That and finally our baking soda. Afterwards, the constituent elements are wet for our paste. The hand is left to the owner to guide us throughout the process until we obtain homogeneous dough. We move to the production process after the presentation of our ingredients, like the sugar cane we are going to put. The eggs.
and border. After mixing and grinding, the dough is homogeneous. We add to our corn flour. With baking soda acting as baking powder. As you can see, it is well mixed. It is homogeneous. It has the color of tomatoes. Then our dough is ready to be prepared. The mold, loaded with thought, are taken to the oven. Fifteen to twenty minutes of patience, our corn flour cupcake are ready to be taken out of the oven. Not far away, biscuit made from plantain flour are being prepared. For our cupcake straight out of the oven, they are very soft at first glance. These delights are not very leavened, but that is justified. Since there is no gluten inside, it is corn, thus it cannot swirl like normal cakes. As you can see, it is ready but not sharp. The time has come to unmold our cupcake and I'm happy to get the first step of dripping them. So, who should taste firstly Coralie? <laughs> mm. And the advantage of consuming cakes like this is that you feel light, that is, not the type having weight, you feel at ease, the intestine supports because you digest it easily. Ladies and gentlemen, you're all welcome back. After watching this film, all you have to do is to rush to this biscuit or cupcake. Why not buy your cassava, egusi, or corn flour to make yours at home? With this, it only remains me to wish you a good program continuity. Let's meet next Monday at the same time in the same channel. Bye bye.